do you like books of Paulo Coelho? Oh my God, I actually checked the pronunciation and it's so tough to pronounce. So I'll say Paulo Coelho, okay, because that's easier for me. But if you like his books, you might be wondering what else should you read by him or which book is the best one to pick up. If that's what you want, I have a video to help you out. Hi guys, I'm Manpreet and I make book related videos on this channel and in today's video, I'm going to tell you about the books of Polo Polo that I have read, that I like or dislike so that you can choose from the pile I know about and you know, make your decision about whether you want to read those books or not. So if you're interested, make sure you subscribe and your notifications are on because I post videos daily or at least I'm trying to this month so that you get all the notifications of the videos I post. Without further ado, let's get started with this video. Book number one that I read by Polo Colo was The Alchemist and I had two copies of this book and right now I have none to show you. Trust me people, it's bad time. It's bad time. Anyway, this book is actually a very teeny tiny book which is about the story of this shepherd who wants to discover treasure or who is on a journey. So this is typically a book where just a shepherd is going on a journey. And this is actually a very philosophical journey. All the books of Polo Polo are filled with philosophy and life lessons. So that is what this book is about. And I personally didn't like this book that much, but it's a book which a lot of my friends absolutely love. And I trust those friends and I would definitely recommend it to you guys. But I want you to start with some other book, which is my favorite. And that is Brida by Polo Colo. Now this book is about this girl who is on a quest for knowledge she meets a lot of different people not a lot but some different people in her attempt to find true knowledge and this has a lot of you know concepts about witches and it also has a soulmates concept which actually made me fall in love with this book like this book is something which i feel like my perspective towards relationships in my life has improved so much because of this book and it has been a long time since I read this book and I definitely want to read it again and it's my absolute favorite by the way guys I think I have reviewed all the Polo Polo books on my blog so if you want to know about full reviews like my full fledged thoughts on what I think about this book just after I read it then do check the description after watching this video and check all of those reviews Next book that I read by Polo Colo and again it's my absolute favorite is 11 Minutes by Polo Colo. Now this book is a story of a prostitute and the very fact, the very subject of this book makes it so challenging to read and it also makes you, you know, think from a different perspective. It opens up your mind and I feel like I am a better reader because I read this book, I understood it and I appreciated it. So it's a definite and must read for all the Polo Polo fans. And if you haven't read it, read it right now. The next book that I read by this author and I really liked is The Devil and Miss Prim. Now the story of this book is that there's a stranger who comes into this very peaceful town and he has a proposition. He says he has like a big bunch of gold bars hidden somewhere in the town and he will give those bars he will give the address or location to those to somebody but they have to commit a crime for that and this first this mystery and I feel like uh, when I read it uh, the, the mystery part which will be like what is the crime that is not like uh, you know intensified in this book it's actually given in the very beginning the actual book is about this whole dilemma of the people whether they want to commit this crime or not and it's a very nice and good book to read this book presents you a picture of the inner struggle and the test for inner strength and i kind of really like this book i think i gave it 3.5 out of 5 stars but the fact that i still remember a lot about this book says a lot about this book it's a very short read but it really helps you out if you are reading it from the right perspective with polo polo guys you have to read it from the right mindset because you cannot just be like there was nothing in the story and all that even though the stories are really good but the real gems lie in the philosophies explained in the story so you have to keep them in mind while reading the book the next book that i have read is the zahir by polo polo now it's not my 
favorite kind of book by this author it's actually about this author whose wife leaves him and he's on a journey to rediscover himself and get his wife back and it just didn't click with me although i did like some concept for the for example there's a concept of favor bank in this book which has really helped me shape what i want to do in my life and you know there are teeny tiny chunks of knowledge in every single book of his that can really make a difference in your life and that is why i love his books but this book was not my absolute favorite i would really say that if you're done with the first four books that i mentioned you can pick up this book the next book is the witch of portobello and this book is actually about this lady she changes so much because of her self discovery and she becomes this amazing person which you will really like but i really feel it depends on people's perspective but i really like the kind of air she gets when she goes through this self discovery phase and she becomes a really nice person but she is accused of being a witch because of that and it's actually written in a very nice manner it's actually a book that is narrated by her friends all the people who knew her are describing what happened to her and how it happened to her and it's really really nice to read and then all the lessons like literally there are pages in this book which i click the pictures of and i have them in my phone because they were so good so i really like this book i would say if you want to read the fifth book of polo polo this should be the one Next book is The Spy by Paulo Coelho. Now, it's like my least favorite book of the author. And it's not like this book is not good. It's really good. It's a story of this uh, person called Mata Hari who was accused of espionage and she was sentenced to death. And it is written in the form of letters where she explains where she you know tries to prove her innocence but obviously we know she was actually sentenced to death because nobody cared about her. And it's it's just her story. Now, it's really good it's not like it's bad it doesn't have that um, you know philosophical aspect to it it doesn't have that polo polo factor which is why i didn't like this book much but if you really are interested because this is like a character who is very popular in history so if you are really interested to know more about her go ahead and pick this book now i do own two more books by polo polo adult free and the winner stands alone and i have read good things about both of these books but i haven't read them yet so i'll be reading that soon and yes that's my cue for you guys if you haven't subscribed or if you're new here to subscribe to my channel if you want to see me reading these books and tell you guys about what i think about these books yes guys these are all the polo polo books that i wanted to talk to you guys about and i hope you got some suggestions about the books you want to read i already gave you the order read brida first then 11 minutes then maybe alchemist then devil and miss prim and then witch of portobello and then the spy then the zahir and rest i do not know because i haven't read them yet but i'll be reading them soon thank you so much for watching this video i hope you really liked it and if you did make sure you hit a thumbs up and also comment below with the polo polo books you have read or if you want me to do this kind of video for some other author as well thank you so much for watching this video this is be signing off i'll be back with another video very soon